Hi guys, welcome to 123MyIT's tutorial on how to uh, set up remote connection to your iPhone uh, from your PC. Now you need to jailbreak your phone before you attempt this. Okay, Once you've jailbroken your phone, you should have Cydia on there. Click on Cydia. And then you'll need to download. First you'll need to search. You hit your search button down the bottom here. And up the top, type in VNC. So VNC, I don't know if you can really see that there, it's a bit hard, but VNC, hit that one, alright, and then you can click install VNC and confirm, alright, now what this does is this will actually install the app VNC, um, and then what you need to do on your either your Windows or your Mac, you need to go to what's called uh, uh, the website um, the VNC website and download an application called Type VNC Viewer. Um, and what I'll do is I'll, I'll have that application um, available for you to download on my website. So then my website 123myit.com uh, and you can download that. So once this is installed, um, what we'll need to do then is we'll need to actually uh, set a password on the device. Um, for some reason I wasn't able to connect to the device until I put a password in there. I'll show you that in a second. I'll just keep the movie running for a few seconds, it shouldn't take too long, it's actually uh, fair, fairly quick and hopefully it'll work straight away. Alright, so it wants you to restart the springboard. across and now what we want to do is um, we want to go in and just check the settings so if we go to settings scroll down the bottom right and you should have an application down the bottom there now called VNC all right now I'll just delete out this password um, I'll put a password in one two three my IT hit return. All right. The other thing you need to check now is you need to get the IP address of your of your phone. So first of all let's turn our Wi-Fi on here. All right, it's connected to our home wireless. All right. And it's given us an IP address which is here. Let's see if you can give that. You probably can't see it very well but it's 10.1.1.5 and then what you do is on your PC, you actually once you download the Type VNC Viewer, which is just a download, I'll make it available on my website as well, so you can just download it. A screen pops up and it will it wants that IP address here. So we just type that in 10.1.1.5. Alright, then we hit connect. Okay guys, so um, one, one last setting that you need to check when you're trying to do the remote connection as well is uh, if you go back into your settings, go down the bottom here again to your VNC and then you'll have this, these two options here. So one is show cursor, so you can actually show your cursor on your remote connection and the other one is um, just enabling the VNC. So if you have both of those off it's also not going to work. Alright, so let's just turn both of those on. Alrighty, and now we should be able to just uh, on our Type VNC software here, we should just be able to hit connect, type in the password that we put into into the iPhone, which was one two three my IT, and there we go. So we've got a remote connection now to your device. All right, so just to show you that that's working, if we go into settings. It will actually change on the screen as well. Um, you know, 
we can go into your Wi-Fi settings again and everything's changing on here and you can you can re control it from the PC as well so if you just wanted to go back out of there I can move my PC on my mouse without actually touching it um, yeah so that's pretty much it so the idea behind this is that you can do you know, a tutorial or something like that that would help it is, is a much easier way of um, doing a tutorial for uh, for IT if you have to do anything like that okay guys alright so um, yeah so those files will be up on my website um, so give that a visit let me know if this was helpful um, I think that this application is really helpful and I'm kinda glad that I jailbroke my phone to, to get to, to use it so thanks a lot guys bye bye